I'm so excited for this fight, man. When this replacement got announced like a few days ago, my heart literally dropped. But I hate watching this fight, man. I hate watching this fight. Why do I hate watching this fight? Because I love Islam and Volkanovski the same, bro. I literally love them the same, man. So what happens if someone that I like the same, like two fighters that I like the same are fighting each other? What I do is I root for the underdog. That's just how I do it. So last fight, Volkanovski was the underdog. And this fight, he's even a big underdog. He's even a bigger underdog, bro. But if Volkanovski pulls the upset and beats Islam on like 13-day notice, literally off the couch, going up in weight class, of course, and having surgery in July on his elbow, bro, where does that place him? Is in your mind, uh, and maybe you don't want to say this because of the type of person that you are, <laughs> but do you think... If you pull this off, you should go down as the greatest of all time or one of the greatest fighters of all time. Does this cement it right here? Is this it? I mean, I'm not I like, well, oh, man, like, oh, you know, it's not, that's not up to me. But I mean, I'm doing these things to, to chase. But they're, they're, that's what I'm trying to reach. They're them, them things, you know what I mean? And when you reach them things, that's what I mean by setting yourself up for the rest of your life, uh, looking after my family for the rest of my life. And that's, that's what it's all about. So, um, I mean, Doing things like this uh, definitely separates you from, from you know, a lot of people. Like you know what I mean. So, um, yeah. So that, that that's what that's what I want to do. And obviously, I want to be active. Now he didn't give a yes or no answer, but he kind of did. He did say like I do these things to separate myself from others. Now. In my eyes, like in my opinion, I'm sure a lot of people's opinions, right? He's one of the GOATs. Now, I'm not saying he's top two, top three right now, okay? But he's one of the GOATs. He's up there, maybe top five, top ten of all time, right? But if he wins, if he beats Islam, now I'm not saying he's going to do it. It's hard for me to, it's hard for me to say, yeah, he's going to beat Islam. Because Islam's a monster, bro. Let's be real, dude. But if he beats Islam on short notice, on 13-day notice, he had surgery, bro, surgery, dog, on his elbow in July. And going up in weight class. If he beats Islam, in my eyes, he's going to be top three GOAT of all time. For me, it's John Jones, okay? If he, let's just say he beats Islam. It'll be John Jones, it'll be Volkanovski, it'll be a Khabib. Okay, that, that'll be my top three. Now, I know everyone's is different, but if he beats Islam, man, like, I'm rooting for him, bro. I'm rooting for, I, like I said, bro, if I like two fighters the same, I root for the underdog. And how can you not like Volk? How can you not like Islam, too? Islam, bro, it's, it's Islam, dog. But Volkanovski, man, this is chasing greatness, bro. This is chasing greatness. I know some people are saying, oh, he has nothing to lose. I think he even said it. He has, I think he's just saying that, but, like, he has nothing to lose. He's not fighting for his belt. He's going up in weight class. All the pressures on Islam. But dude, you guys are like I just said, dog. He had surgery in July. Like that's he had surgery on his elbow. Like, what if he gets re-injured? You guys know, man, these fighters, if they get injured, it's a big deal, bro. They lose a lot of time, like, and, and he's not young, man. So, in my opinion, this is just my opinion, man. If he pulls it off, if he pulls off the up upset, beats Islam on 13-day notice, off the couch, literally, going up in weight class. And had surgery in July on his elbow. If he beats Islam, he's goaded, man. He'll be goaded. It's like, who knows where he'll be in the goat status. Everyone's is different. But for me, he'll be two, man. He'll be number two. Let me know what you think of this in the comments. If he beats Islam, where does he rank in the goat in the goat conversation? Let me know what you think of this in the comments. It'll mean the world to me if you like and subscribe. Don't forget to hit the note. Thank you so much for watching.